What's going on, guys? Keith the Trucker checking in. Another episode of Sports Bank Cross America. Boy, we are cooking the last couple nights with some NBA plays. We've had back to back nights with VIPs hitting. Um, guess what? I put all my VIP picks the last couple days for free on the free plan. I told you guys all you gotta do is go sign up. Um, uh, we had this one hit last night. I think I might have put this one on the uh, video too. I can't remember or not, but I definitely put it on winnable. So that was an easy one. I wish I could put more than 10. I used to put like 60 to 80 on these little two mans. So like, you know, risk a couple units to win six. You know what I mean? Two to win, two units to win six. So seriously you guys are missing out i mean i'm giving out free money here you just got to go to this site it's super easy winnable.com slash sbaa sign up for the free plan it literally costs nothing you don't even have to put a credit card up nothing like that and then you'll get my free picks and you'll win money like this one that hit last night so this was a play that i posted for free on winnable last night maybe an hour and a half two hours before the game started Easy win, guys. Easy win. And it was cool for me because in Tennessee, they do all peer-to-peer. -peer. So this is underdogs peer-to-peer. -peer. It's called the Champions League. This was only a $20 bet uh, to win 200 If you guys would have played this on price picks or on underdog, no matter, you know, if you're not in the Champions League, if you're just on normal, it would have paid it would have paid 10x. So $20 would have won you 200 But for me, since there was only a few winners... Let's see if I can zoom in on that. I won 400, which is awesome for me personally. That's a, you know, it's double what I, you know, normally would have won. Sometimes it doesn't go your way like that, though. Sometimes it could be cut in half, you know, if you have a lot of guys winning. But it's nice. And I noticed on Underdog, it seems to be paying out more fairly more often than stupid DraftKings, man. I, that, that side, I'm, if I ever recommended that site to you guys, I do apologize. They're just, it's been so disappointing. I'm going to do two videos today. Excuse me. I'm having like an allergic attack. Uh, the first one is going to be just a couple NBA plays, and then I'm going to dive into, so it's the second one's going to be all NFL matchups for uh, conference weekend. But seriously, one last time, get on winnable. Uh, I'm telling you guys, it's so awesome. Like anytime I make a play for free, I, I send it out and it just text you or emails you, whatever you select, select in the option there. So head on over there and then uh, do me one more favor, guys. Just like this video, leave a comment if you got time, and definitely subscribe if you haven't yet. Appreciate all the support. The channel is growing. Um, not yesterday for whatever reason, but the day before, I, I noticed that when I just do a simple search for my channel now, like we're actually like one of the top options, like the channels at the top, but like the whatever video I posted that day. So I think the, the likes that you guys are giving me are working uh, so we can grow and get to a broader audience. And um, we also had I think I had the most views on a video two days ago. So we're definitely trending in the right direction. To try to grow the channel, guys. A couple losers last night. Um. So I'm in the, you know, like the uh, Champions League that Underdog has. They call it the Arena League in prize picks. But Giannis just let us down on this one. But you can see we're starting to heat up on these props. We're getting, we're getting a lot more green the last couple days. I told you guys slumps just don't last forever. And if I would have paired any one of these guys on that one and then just had, like, you know, that's the kind of the luck, right? So, like, I cannot believe this guy didn't get three assists. He averages three a game. It was such a good matchup. For him to get like an extra assist or two, I thought he'd go for four or five. Fucking zero, man. Fucking sucks, right? So anyway, but my point is if I would have taken any one of these props and just happened to stick it right where this one is, that would have been another winner. That's just how it goes sometimes. And the NBA, you know, it's hard to correlate. So, but you can see all that green, right? That's, that's a uh, six and two on a, uh, on, two, on eight props. And unlike, you know, these clowns that I told you guys about the other day, well, what, what good is it if I just get on the screen here and show you guys like, oh, I like this prop. And then, oh, you know, I like that other one on the other side. Like you got to mash them up somehow. You got to find a way to make money off of them. So uh, we did. I did show you both the winners. I had a couple more, too, on the sports books. 
And then we're going to give you guys a couple free plays today. Um, I like this game right here. Uh, normally, I don't stick teammates. I try to avoid PRAs with teammates. I probably should have put him on the other slip, but I still like this one. These are low enough numbers, and the matchup's good. Should be a high-scoring game against uh, the Hornets. And then these bad boys are playing each other. Uh, the, I mean, the, literally the last two league MVPs, Embiid won it last year. Jokic probably should have, but Jokic won it the year before. So when these two like go head to head, I mean, they ju it just happened like five games ago, and they were uh, I think Jokic might have been one under that, and Embiid hit by like I think he had like 58. So I expect them to ball out and uh, take a screenshot of that. That's a free play today. I wish I could put more money down on on uh, NBA or specifically NFL, but I'm limited on prize picks, guys. So I have to stick to like twenty to ten dollars a play, basically. Oh, that's the one I just showed you guys. So let's see here. Okay, so this is another one, and you can notice it's got those same two guys, right, Embiid and Jokic. But what I did here, and this is a smart strategy. Sometimes when you really like players, like getting multiple exposure to them on props that are like potentially likely to hit like there's a chance he gets 30 points tonight but has a lackluster night rebounding he like some reason he only has like eight boards well he's not going to hit his pra line if he only gets eight rebounds tonight right but he could hit his point line and we've seen this happen multiple times so i like these two players a lot they're going to be on the thumbnail of this video at least one of them and um then you have um uh, so you just have a different look like, you know, like so he could he could go 39 points, but have 10 boards and only like five assists. Well, he's not in his PRA line, but he's going to hit his point line. And then these uh, D'Angelo Russell's just been hot against the Warriors. I think it's a decent spot. He should have some opportunities to shoot some threes. Uh, they play at a decent pace. So and then Sexton, we're going to give him another shot to bounce back here. He's got that same. I'm getting exposure to the Jazz against the Hornets. So I'm giving you these guys uh, for free. And hopefully we can get at least one of them to hit for y'all. That's going to be it today on NBA, I think. Let me double check, make sure I don't have anything else for you guys. Um, once again, uh, just a reminder too, if you use promo code at Winnable, if you want to try my VIP out, I'm going to have a lot of plays on there tonight for the NFL weekend. And you get it 75% off if you use this promo code right here. Okay. Keith the Trucker is checking out on this video. I will have an NFL one up at some point tonight for you guys. Um, like just to show you too, like on prize picks, because it's the Arena League, I don't even have an NFL line yet. See, it's nowhere up here. It'd normally be one of these first two. So I don't have anything up here um, for NFL, and I'm guessing it's not going to happen until tomorrow. So the good news, it's bad news, good news. The good news is everyone's going to have the same line. So we're all going to be betting on the exact same lines most likely. It may shift a little bit, like if like a bunch of people come in and take it over, they may up the line. Um, but the other good news is, is uh, I suppose, is that anybody who bets on any of these up here all day long, right, from tomorrow, like at midnight, I'm assuming is when NFL will drop on here. That means I'll be potentially in a pool with anybody that could be betting on soccer with NHL. So the player pool is massive. And one thing I forgot to show you guys with this arena league, it's kind of weird. But so this one didn't give me anything back, right? It was just a $20 loss. But this one, uh, actually, even though I didn't hit this, it actually paid me back 33 bucks. So I made 13 33 on that um, just because there was nobody in it that actually got four out of four, which is kind of, kind of, kind of incredible, you know? So, hey, that's cool. That's the one of the benefits of peer-to-peer, -peer, I suppose, you know. Now, this is just a power play. It wasn't a flex play or anything. So, uh, anyway, guys, that's all I got for NBA today. And uh, good luck. Let's make some freaking money today. Keep the truckers checking out on this video. Like I said, I will have an NFL one up at some point tonight, guys. Good luck. Peace.